mosquito. This is the line that I'm seeing right now. Ukishindwa uza majani na usiulize ni majani gani. <laughs> okay, so Tiziana came through and you asked for her social media. Now she's here. She's representing all the way and she'll be telling us if she's living up to her name because in terms of Greek, the name Tiziana means being a giant. <laughs> Are you feeling up to that? Tiziana. A gap. Uh. Tiziana. Not really. Uh -huh. I'm nothing like a giant. You're nothing oh. like a giant. But no, I'm a giant in this industry, so. <laughs> the attitude is on point, and that's why I love it. Digital Esther, <laughs> thank you for the good mixes that you're giving us. Pinginu Tambiotin Yumbani on social media, how they can get through to you. Um, you can find me on each and every social media at DJ Tiesca, and you can find my mixes at www.mixcloud.com slash DJ Tiesca. Okay, so right. Tiziana, you're telling us that you, in terms of a giant, you yeah. story. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm coming through, so watch this space. I'm new. I'm not new. I've been, I've been around, like me. Girl, you're not yeah. new. You're half a day here in this <laughs> game. Please tell us. Okay. Tell us more about you. Well, I'm from Mombasa, Tiziana. I'm a rapper. Yes, and I want people to know me more, listen to my music, and yes, I'll be giving you more and more good stuff. All right. You self-named yourself mm -hmm. as a bad girl. Kadem Back in Kabaya. Kadem Kabaya. And yes. it's all that in the attitude and the how aggressive, <laughs> positive you are in terms of the music video. Mm -hmm. Tell us about that uh, new jam. No, sorry, the first project in yes. 2014. And then you tell us more of uh, is the attitude the same as we meet you in person? Uncle Fate has grown right now from 2014. Uh, that was my very, very first project. And it was just a fun video. And I was young by then, I was 23, yeah. Okay. So I was just being this wild girl, showing off and all that, so that's Kadim Kabaya. All right. He doesn't so have a long story mm -hmm. behind it, so yeah. So after Kadim Kabaya, you went to on studio and released the new jam. Uh, tell us, uh, wh why hip-hop music before you get to your another jam after Kadim uh, Kabaya? Okay, hip-hop is a culture, hip-hop is a movement, and I actually didn't know I could rap back in the day, because I used to sing. But then someone told me that, OK, in Kenya, Akuna Mokfems is Wengi Vile, so you can try. And I tried it, and it worked out. So that's, that's just how it is. <laughs> so you just tried it. Wait, you went to the studio, and you just tried it, and what was Kubali just like that? Sime Kubali. I told you guys she has an attitude. And <laughs> having a aggressive, positive, positive attitude is the way to go, especially into the rap game. Yeah. You know, you have to put up the respect on the name. Tell us, uh, in, when you look into, still on the aggressive part, mm -hmm. and uh, let's look at, back into 1980s, when you look into the hip hop music world, yeah. uh, it well started from back then, when you look about women being objectified in terms of the musical videos and lyrics. Yeah. What's your take on that? And uh, do you see, I have seen it a couple of times in terms of music videos and uh, uh, that we actually drop as artists back at home, yes. So tell us more about women being objectified in uh, videos. What's your take on that? Is it okay or is it a art for you? Or is that okay, I, I don't have a problem with that. It's totally okay because it's art and women are sexy, they're beautiful, so if they come out as video vixens and show their, as in show what their mama gave them, I don't, I don't think that's a problem. Yeah, and uh, another thing, hip hop is being classified as uh, using women in what will it? One other one, one to mix with Tunde Mombasa. Yeah, Tunde Mombasa. Eh, ni wana kwa na tumika vibaya, like me. Kama mtu unajeshimu, if you respect yourself and you know what you want to do and you, you have your morals, unajua chini unafuata, if you're, if you're in this to make money or just to bring out your art, that's okay. I, I don't think it's a problem. Okay, so yeah. unapozungumza na isi kwamba unakonania in your music. Yes. Like you have vision and goals because it spoke about if you know what you're doing, then mm. you know the boundaries not to cross. Exactly. As an artist, come aware with yeah. what are the things that you cannot do in terms of your music? Uh, I don't know. I cannot say that I can't do something or I, ca I limit myself in some ways because art is wide. Naiza fanyangoma yenye inaitaji kitu flani. Ama, okay, uh, how can I put this? Naiza fanyangoma ambaye inaitaji, I put myself in a certain way. It's just an act. Nikoma ku act too because it's art. 
so I can put it out in any way. I'm comfortable. Yeah. So Nathani too, it's just venya too unajituma, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So a lady Tiziana na chambia kwamba it's an it's an art. It's mm -hmm. like being in character. If you're yes, an actor, exactly. you just embodied a particular different uh, uh, you know, mm -hmm. character that you're given by the scriptwriter and that's how she does uh her music, I don't know yeah. about you back at home. Mm -hmm. uh, probably for the young ladies or th that are back at home mm -hmm. and they're looking forward to venture into the music scene or they're still into the music scene and they're getting challenges because uh, as you know, as a female rapper, no, things are not that swift. Yes. We cannot sit here and pretend that things are okay mm -hmm. and everything will just mm -hmm. go smoothly. Probably yeah. can highlight on the challenges when, you, when you're starting off as a female rapper and uh, let's go back to Ulambana Taka Kuanza. Vito Mbavu Nidho Mwambia like, I square in a pressure probably in anything or whatever. Okay. Okay. Music. What I will say, don't be in a hurry because success does not come overnight. You have to work really hard, find a good music, do good music. Uneza may record so many so many tracks, like 20 or 50 or 100, like any. There's just one that is going to bring you out there, you know. So, yeah, where in the letter to Kufanya BD, do your stuff, Usiskize Watu, people, Kwanza Watu Wakikunini, Wakikukashif. It gives you more zeal when mm -hmm. they kufanya even more and more. Yani nakupa ile motisha. So yeah, I could say, endele ni tu yani. Ata mimi badu na endele. So ya fika badu. I'm not even a quarter of where I want to be. So it's just kujituma na bidi and all that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> I love the fact that you say stay focused and don't uh, don't to put much of your time to and. Uh, to hearing what people have to say mm -hmm. about you and yeah. what you're doing in terms of your art and whatever mm -hmm. uh, career you're into. Yes. Let's look, go back to, that just links us to the new jam that you've just released mm -hmm. two weeks ago and people back at home are actually responding quite nicely. Mm -hmm. It's just been two weeks since the drop. Yeah. Who are you? Who are you? Uh -huh. <laughs> Tell us more about that song. Well, who are you? Uh, I did it in, I recorded it in Mombasa with Techniques. Actually, I did the song last year and we did the video this year around feb yeah we did it with director s it's just a song about the same thing i was saying who are you okay the lyrics go like who are you to judge me like i'm doing my thing you're doing yours mm -hmm. i'm living my way you're living yours so mm -hmm. you cannot judge me who are you to judge me yeah mm -hmm. just if you're it's self-explanatory so okay so pali nyumbani guys back at home you reach out to her you can probably give out your social media handles they can go through uh the music that you're talking about if they're yet to see it the visual mm -hmm. aspect of it is on point uh yeah. goodness to the director and the producer behind that new jam known as who are you probably can give out your social media handles as mm -hmm. we continue with this interview tunda tiziana tunda okay my name my other name is zabibu so zabibu you know it's a fruit Kwayo Tunda underscore Tiziana on all platforms at a YouTube. Go check out the new video. It's popping. All right. Like popping. Let's go back to, <laughs> <laughs> I see what you did there. Uh, let's yeah. go back to two years back. Mm -hmm. And I was going through uh, your YouTube channel and yes. people back at home can equally see this. You collaborated with Kiki. Kiki is very outspoken. She's yes. a very well-known artist, rapper. Mm -hmm. And she's good at what she does. And yeah. she, she's, she's a, like when she, drops the lyrics the bars they're on point and she's a she doesn't care mm -hmm. what people have to say yes. and she's on point like in terms of who are you you know yeah. so i saw you collaborating with her mm -hmm. and uh, i would like to know what it, what it feels like to be in the studio uh are the energies leveled up and how that was the experience uh, it was a good experience kiki is a, is a long time friend and we are still planning even to work in more other projects together in future mm -hmm. so yeah uh, she's a friend a sister and yeah we, we're in this together and let's know what to tambue from mombasa okay yes so <laughs> just uh, winding up but not really mm -hmm. i would like us to do something yeah i will drop a name of an artist mm -hmm. and you give me one word that will describe their art oh Okay. Okay. This is yes. goes back to uh, we're going back to zero chills, the jam that you released. And <laughs> people back at home still <laughs> on our YouTube channel, you can reach out and see zero chills, yeah. and you'll see you get to see this jam that we're referring to while I'm dropping these names. Mm -hmm. So I'll start off with uh, the rapper and Jerry. Jerry. Mm, one word uh, that describes her art. Photographer. I love her <laughs> photos. <laughs> <laughs> that is so true. I see that <laughs> on IG, she's actually doing yes. a job as a as a rapper. As a rapper, she I. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go with the ecstatic. Ecstatic. Um. 
Uh, okay, I could say she's one of the pioneers. Like, you see Kitambo, like, yeah, that's what I could say about her. Would you collaborate with her? And then jam? Ah, uh, I'd love to. She's good. She's good. I love her vibe, yes. But that's not what we hear on Zero Chest, though. Ah, that was <laughs> another story <laughs> okay. about her. Yeah, but which story was that? Uh, about her being okay, in it was just music to her too, yeah, could you express to uh she's an atheist and all that. Yeah. Like in deep into that. I only So anyway. okay, so so kitambo come up. All right, so <laughs> let's okay, the last name that I'm going to drop is yeah. uh Femi One. Femi One. Yeah. Uh Kapuka. Did you just go with Kyo? I said, I'm surprised. <laughs> we just drop in the mic and we shall, we shall, we shall actually live now, right? <laughs> so, what's your uh, reason? Most of her tracks ni ni hizo tuza. Kujirusha nini. Okay, anafanyaga hip hop sometimes and then she goes to Kapuka. Okay, which is not a bad thing. So, you may say, I just described them very yeah. yes. well. Oh. So, uh, she's doing her thing. She'll, I respect it. So. It's right. <laughs> tell me more, uh, tell me the artists that you like to collaborate with for uh, local uh, hip hop music scene. Uh, even in different genre. In any different genre. I'd love to collab with Dr. Pizzo. I know he's selfish, he's not <laughs> he's not a collab guy, but yeah, I feel his vibe and I love his music. I feel we can work on something good. Okay, nice. that's Tiziana for yes. you and she's looking forward to work with Octo. So Octo, mm -hmm. all the way from Australia, you got this. <laughs> Tiziana, the giant in terms of our lyrics. Yeah. She'll love to work with you. So that's uh, that's about it. Uh, unless I am leaving out, do you have any new jam coming up? No, we have two weeks, but probably do you have any other projects? Because I have a couple of artists who say, like I've released an, uh, a song right. and I'm still working on my album. I have an EP coming through. So probably you're in the same lane. Okay, uh, right now I'm still working. I'm just working on singing. Goals. I dropped this one and I want to do another video soon so I can drop it. Yeah, so uh, right now I'm just being singles, but maybe in future I'll do a compilation, a mixtape, or an EP. I'm an album peer. Yeah. I'm an album. Yeah, we're at work. I'm a nena, when I'm a dad. So to put here uh, a few lyrics or bars on any choice yeah, of your song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Tiziana Kalika Dem Kabaya, Miss ATT. Boss of all bosses, I'm the queen, Waki Dibetus King. I just get your chote, I rule the math, the baddest ever seen. Now listen, be Whoa. keen. I'm killing bits on serial, original material, giving you tutorials. I'm imperial, double trouble, I'm a bust your bubble, mini pro. Kwa hii mitambo, si leo tu, toka kitambo. Nipate kwenye book, nikifanya mambo. Kao kou flani, nafanya mambo. Straight to the point, no mambo jambo, nimekuja tena. Full pack, ile noma, wabaya mtakoma. Cheki vile mina chana. Easy line. Tamu kama mananasi. Tamu kama mananasi. Tiziana, for you, the giant in lyrics yeah. aspect of it. So... I'm going to give you this time mm -hmm. to introduce your new jam, yeah. Who Are You, Who on Camera you? 4. And then DJ TSC is going to uh, flip it. And then we get to hear this new jam. And you get to see what I was talking about in terms of the visual. Mm -hmm. Camera 4, it's yours, yeah? Okay. Introduce <laughs> the jam. And then Tiaska will be doing justice on that. Mm -hmm. T, Tiziana, Who Are You, Who Are You? That's my new video. Check it out on YouTube. Subscribe to my channel, Tunda Tiziana. Yeah. Who are you? Kubwa? Ini Kubwa?